So, my days in this uh, place are over. Uh, I'm moving out from this place. Uh, so actually, here was quite interesting to work. I make several videos here. And now is the time to move out. And yeah, so this room was for special projects. Uh, then we come over here. And here was the place where we make research on paints and so on. So this piece of equipment was also really really important because you need some couch to sit down to rethink everything and yeah this was I mean this this is really important uh, part of the equipment. So each laboratory or some workshop need some couch to rethinking everything uh, yeah but I'm still here uh, I also have some materials left uh, and I think that it's time for the last project So some of my friends asked me if I can make some really really simple pressure sensor which will change which will change the resistance uh, when you press the sensor. So more you press the sensor uh, lower will be the resistance and less you press higher will be the resistance. And now let's make some pressure sensor. So to make some pressure sensor you need some normal tape. This tape is actually only for the housing uh, of this sensor. Then you also need some electrodes. For the electrodes you can use some aluminium tape or copper tape. And you also need some conductive foam or conductive fiber or something like this. Uh, in my case I will use some graffiti common fiber. So here I cut the electrodes. I have two aluminum electrodes. Here you see I have this normal tape. And on this normal tape I will put the first aluminum uh, electrode. Like so. On this aluminium electrode, oh, on this aluminium electrode, I will put this regular fifty column fiber. Like so. And on the top, so it's actually better if uh, the graffiti common fiber put that way because you don't want that this aluminium, uh, this aluminium electrode will stick to the button one and now I will put the second aluminium uh, electrode on the top of this graffiti carbon fiber and to seal everything I will use the second uh, normal tape to seal everything together.
and that's it. Really simple and also really fast made. Right now I get around 80, 90, maybe 100 ohms. If I press a little bit, you see some changing. I just slightly press the sensor. And if I press a little bit harder, I get the resistance down to 1 ohm. Okay, really nice. Thirty nose, thirty nose, ohms, thirteen ohms, so the surface is a little bit small for this one. So actually it's also possible to make some scale uh, from this setup. So this what I show you is really really basic and really simple pressure sensor. But it's also possible to make some scale uh, for weight of the kilograms of some object. Because the resistance of this sensor will be different on each weight which you put on the top of the sensor so if you are interested to make some scale uh, on this principle uh, I need to say that uh, if you make like this will not be very very good because for the electrodes you need some uh, solid uh, aluminium plate because here I use some aluminium tape to make everything flexible uh, but for the scale is better if you use some solid two solid pieces of aluminium plates uh, also uh, you can also replace this carbon fiber uh, graffiti carbon fiber with some I don't know conductive rubber or something like this uh, but this one, uh, which is graffiti carbon fiber, is a little bit easier to get. And for the programming of this scale, I was thinking that if you put some, some weight which have exactly one kilogram, you put on the scale and you measure the resistance. And this resistance will be your one kilogram. But you also need to repeat several times uh, to be sure that uh, this ohms reading is exactly one kilogram. Also the same you make with 100 grams. You put some weight which have 100, uh, 100 grams on the scale and again you measure the resistance. And this resistance will be your 100 grams. And again you need to repeat several times that you are sure that this resistance will give you 100 grams or 100 grams will give you uh, this resistance and yeah so this was just the idea to make some uh, some scale on this principle but this one 
is some pressure sensor. So uh, if you want to make some scale, don't do this this way. Uh, and yeah, that's it for now. And we see us in the next video in some another place. Bye.